going to edit the display options in this object now. So this is a simple flashcard. I'm going to go and edit the settings for this activity. I'm going to scroll down past the main content that we've added and just have a look at this display options area. So there are three options here, um, display an action bar and frame, allow downloading and an embed button. So the allow download is, is fairly uh, obvious. The other two perhaps take a little bit more explanation. Uh, the display action bar is going to actually enable these other things to display or not. And if I'm doing those in Moodle, for example, or I'm doing them here in h5p.com, those options may be slightly different. So I'm just going to edit a quiz here. Again, looking down at the display options area, uh, just a small menu here with display options being one of the uh, possibilities. I can see that I've got some extra options here and perhaps a bit more text to explain. So I can obviously check these boxes to allow or, or disable people to download that. I can um, display the embed button, which allows us to embed this content in an LMS. We can uh, display the copyright information and also the author's information. So if we have a look at that, actually in action if I just view my activity I can see the display bar here um, and that will provide me with access to first of all to embed in this case so I can take this information and use that to embed this content within my LMS whichever LMS that happens to be or it might be a CMS um, I can also uh, allow that download we can also hit reuse and that allows us to copy information now as i'm the author on this site i can actually copy this activity into another activity in using that method so that's quite interesting and then finally here we've got the copyright information so at the top i'm seeing the meta information that i've added to the content itself and then for every resource that I've used, in this case, lots of images, there is a properly filled out attribution linking to the original image, giving credit to the author and talking about the license that it's available under. Very important that we pay attention to these settings. Um, and again, just to stress, they may be slightly different if you're using h5p.com or if you're using an LMS, there may be differences between what you see.